Hey everybody, Mental Fox here. Welcome to my playthrough of The Last of Us 2. The game just unlocked. It's just a little after 11 p.m. Central Daylight Time where I am right now here in Austin, Texas, which if you watched the first game, you know that's where this started and that's where Joel is from. I don't know if that's interesting or not, but whatever. I'm in Austin. I thought it was cool that the game started in Austin. Um, this is the screen that we're greeted with. Uh, just some, just a boat sitting on a water, on some water here. I don't know what's going to happen when I press any button, but I wanted to make sure that you were here with me when I did it because I'm pretty anxious about playing this game. I have purposely stayed away from any reviews. Uh, I, I watched the uh, trailer for it when it came out a while back, but I have not read really anything else about it. But if you browse the web, you can't help but see things. And I've gotten the impression that this game is pretty bleak. Um, first game was pretty bleak. I mean, you know, zombies. So I'm thinking this one's probably going to be pretty bleak also. I'm glad you're here with me. I'm going to go ahead and press this button. We're going to get started with The Last of Us 2. Let's see what happens when we press this button. supposed to take her to the fireflies and walk away. If you go halfway across the country with someone. She needed her immunity to mean something. Maybe I was starting to buy into that old cure business. Maybe I just wanted to do right by her. And then we made it. We found the firefly. Because of her, they were actually going to make a cure. The only catch. It would kill her. What are you doing? I won't let you take her. This is our future. Think of all the lives we'll save. Jesus Christ, Joel. What do you do? I saved her. a lot. What does Ellie know? I told her they just ran some tests. I told her her immunity meant nothing. And she believed you? Didn't say otherwise. (sighs) 
we should head back. It's okay. I got him. You go on. You sure? Yeah. Right. About what we were talking about earlier. I can't say I'd have done different. Take it to the grave if I have to. I'll see you later.
Kelly. Gave me a heart attack. I tried knocking, but hey. Hey. What's up, Joel? Just checking in. Folks are you know, talking about how impressed they are with you and how well you're. Helping out. It's good. Yeah. Tommy and I went out riding the other day, and he, uh, <laughs> he told me a joke, and I, I thought about you. It's, um, oh, shoot, now I forgot it. Uh, something about a clock. How do you... Joel, it's, uh, it's pretty late, and I gotta get up in a few hours. Yeah, 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 I know, I know. I'm, I'm gonna get out of your hair. I just, um... I, I want to show you something. Just give me one second. What's this? Well, some folks call this thing here a guitar. You want to hear something? Okay. Okay. <laughs> Promise me that you won't laugh. I won't laugh. I won't. I'm trusting you. So we, we get to play the guitar here. Now, I'm going to assume that if you're watching this, uh, you've already played the first game or at least you saw a recap of the game or you're familiar with the story of the first game. Because if not, um, well, the first whole game, the, the whole first game has been spoiled for you. Um, everything that he told Tommy was true. Uh, Joel was basically kind of hired to uh, bring Ellie, the girl here, uh, across country from Boston down to um, somewhere in Wyoming, maybe, uh, where his brother was. And when they got there, well, the reason he was supposed to bring Ellie is because she had been bitten by the, the zombies and she hadn't turned into a zombie. So they figured that maybe she could uh, provide a cure. Well... Joel found out that she could provide a cure, but only if she died, that she'd have to die. And he decided to take her, kill all the doctors that were going to operate on her and take the cure, you know, make a cure. He killed all them and instead stole her away to, I guess, wherever they are now. I guess this is back at Tommy's camp. So it was pretty heavy stuff. Um, so anyway, yes, there's your very, very quick recap of what happened in the first game. And uh, we start off this game. Um, that was me riding the horse. I think I only ran into one tree. <laughs> and uh, now we get to play a chord. So we use the left stick here to choose a chord. And I guess I'm supposed to choose a G. And oh, goody, now I strum by using this thing. Everything I have found here, I'm not found. 
found by myself. Try and sometimes you'll succeed to make this man of me. All my stolen missing parts, I've no need for anymore. As I believe, and I believe, as I can see. Our future days, days of you and me. There you go. Well, that didn't suck. I'll take what I can get. She's yours. No. No, 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 no. I don't know the first thing I about this. I promise that I teach you how to play. You did. What do you say, tomorrow night, first lesson? Deal. Okay. Okay. Did... Do you remember the joke? What is the downside to eating a clock? It's time consuming. That's so dumb. <laughs> yeah. Good night, kiddo. Morning. Sorry, I totally overslept. Just give me a minute and I'll get dressed. I heard you had quite a night after I left. I... She kissed me. It was just Dina being Dina. She didn't mean anything by it. I was talking about your fight with Seth. Wait. You kissed Dina? Oh. I thought this... We're broken up one week and you make a move on my girl? probably just trying to make you jealous. I didn't... I would never... Oh, fuck, this is awkward. I'm messing with you, man. I don't care. Get dressed. You're the worst. It's kind of fucked up you did that. <sighs> Get your stuff together, we're already late. <laughs> okay, so this is... Smells fine. Four years after the guitar thing... Uh, but the guitar thing, we don't know how long it that was after the first game. I don't think it was too long. Um, cause she didn't look that much older to me. And heck, now it's four years after the guitar scene we just saw, and she doesn't look that much older to me here. I guess she does a bit. So uh, we're supposed to get dressed, and um, let's press some buttons and see what happens. If I press this button, uh, nothing happens. Uh, if I press this button, this just brings up options. And, um, okay, that's fine. 
Nothing that's going to give me a quest or tell me where my clothes are or anything. Hey, look, it's a it's a fat PS3. <laughs> so uh, here's a story for you. Um, the Last of Us, the first game, is the game that destroyed my fat PS3. I bought this game. And if you remember, just like this game, The Last of Us 2, coming out very late in the life of the PlayStation 4, the original Last of Us came out pretty late in the life of the PlayStation 3. And um, that's the game that... Or, Last of Us is the game that destroyed my fat PS3. I actually had to buy a new PS3 just to play The Last of Us. Uh, so let's look for some clothes to put on. That's what we're supposed to be doing. I mean, I, this looks like where clothes are. I uh, don't see any option to interact um, to put on clothes. There's the guitar right there. So if this is your first time uh, watching one of my Let's Plays, uh, you should know that I like to be very thorough. I like to explore uh, I like to look at stuff. I like to see the world that these very talented people have created. Um, so I tend to take my time. I tend to be methodical. I try to find everything there is to find, do everything there is to do, but I do still miss things. It happens. Cool, man. A reflection. You don't see that a lot in video games. So, okay, here we go. I guess this is us getting dressed. Put this on. Looks like we've got maybe a diary here that I wish I could read. There's a gun there. We've got a Walkman there, an actual Sony Walkman. I could zoom in a little bit, but not far enough to be able to read the diary. What I think is a diary there. We've got some books there. Are the planets inhabited? Astronomy and space vehicles and the future of space travel. Cool. She likes space stuff. Nice. Okay. Got a transformer there. I mean, this is just cool stuff, man. It kind of lets you, let you in a little bit on Ellie and what she's like. She likes comic books. Rebels of Fire, it looks like. She's got some maybe trading cards there. Maybe, maybe uh, deck building cards, something. I don't know. Got a little uh, wood stove over here. And uh, let's go put on our freaking coat, man, because it's freaking cold. Okay. <sighs> sure. Here we go. All right. Here we go. We're all geared up and ready to go. We don't know what we're getting ready to do. I mean, Ellie knows, but you and I, we don't know. Well, you probably know. You've probably already played this. Knife. Hey, is Joel oh, let's up? go ahead and take the knife. Got reports of infected out north. We sent him and Tommy out early to scout. <sighs> that sucks. Yep. Can't imagine they got much sleep. Definitely not as much as you. <sighs> Shut up. It's just about to get up. I was. You got everything? <sighs> yes. All right, here we go. Got us out of the little house here. Let's run backwards. Heads up. You're the talk of the town this morning. <sighs> what? Let me see if I got this right. You kissed Dina. <sighs> she kissed me. Which triggered Seth to call you a not so nice word. Yep. Then Joel decked him. More of a push. And then you got mad at Joel. That part confused me. It was a strange night, man. Sounds exciting. Maria wants a word with you. Where is she? The diner. Is this about Seth? No clue. Just tell her you never saw me. Nope. Where's your fucking loyalty? Excuse me? Yeah, man. Where's your loyalty? Hey, so... We're okay, right? You and me? Yeah, of course. Dina and I are done. I know. I was just... I don't want you to think... Ellie. We're cool. Promise. Thanks. Oh, 
Hello, dog. Let's pet the dog. Hey, old timer. Yeah, get a good scratch. Nice little town they've got here. Wow, look at all the people walking around. This is kind of cool. So they're doing a pretty good job of at least keeping the infected out of this area so that these people can go ahead and live their lives. It looks like they're having some fun. Not sure how I feel about the cold, though. I think I'd rather be someplace warm. Hey, Jesse. Oh, hi. Hi. Hi, woman. The Tipsy Bison. So, uh, unfortunately, old Jesse here doesn't know how to open doors, so we have to do it for him. Want to grab some breakfast? No. Where's Maria? In the back. So apparently this is very early in the morning. A lot of people hanging out in the bar slash restaurant this early. Excuse me. Ellie. There you are. Come here. Seth's got something he wants to say to you. I don't want to hear what that bigot has to say. Do it for me. Please. <sighs> Fine. Seth. Seth, come here. Hey. Uh, look, last night I was, uh, I was drinking too much. Sure. I'm trying to say I'm sorry. Maria tells me that you and Dean are headed out. I, uh, made you some sandwiches. Okay. Or steak. Thank you, Seth. Yeah, well, uh, you be safe out there. Yep. I appreciate that. What you got there? Bigot sandwiches. Mmm. Smells good. They're yours. You sure? It's fine. Let me walk you out. Okay. Are we going with them? I guess so. When you go out, I want you to trade off with Tommy and Joel. Those boys have been out for far too long. Where do I meet them? If you go up to the Northwest Lookout, they're scheduled to arrive later today. But watch yourself. I mean, there's too many sightings of infected recently. Of course. I was going to check out the creek trails. I'll need someone else to cover it. Ellie, you know the creek trails? Not really. All right. Dean has done it a bunch. I'll have the two of them take it. Ellie, can I talk to you for a sec? Hmm. Let's talk to uh, this woman here. But uh, first, let's look at the board. Attention lost and found is moved due to space issues. The lost and found is now located at the end of Main Street in New Buck Leather. We've got a winter dance here. Free puppies to anyone that'll take one. A winter dance sign-up sheet. Ooh, did Ellie sign up? Uh, Christine, Veronica, Astrid, William, Heather, Kaylee. Oh, okay. And Jeremy. That's the stuff that everybody's bringing. Guess Ellie's not bringing anything, huh? Okay. This week's movie is rated G, kid-friendly, house-breaking Rufus. So here's a note from Dina. Whoever stole Japan's blanket, bring it back. He is getting cold. Don't be an ass. Somebody's name is Japan. Okay. Maybe, I was thinking maybe a pet. Maybe. There's a note here, but we can't read it. All right, let's not be rude and keep this woman waiting. Let's talk to her. So, look, I don't know what's going on with you and Joel. <sighs> Maria, the guy really cares about you, and I'm sure he didn't mean to. We're fine. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Sorry to pry. Be safe. Thanks. Yo, Dina! Assignments! 
Just give me a minute. Can we get your girlfriend to the stables, please. Hey, Dina. Can I talk to you? <laughs> hey, guys. I'm tapping out. Come on. How long? Whew. Hey. Hey. Um, I just want to say sorry for running off last night. Oh, that's, it's okay. I totally get it. I, <laughs> I just, I felt bad. Why? Because I started the whole thing, and I just, sh I shouldn't have kissed you in front of all of those people. And no, you were drunk, it's fine. Well, still, I just, I don't want you to think. No, I'm not reading into it or anything. Just... You know what I love about you? How you let me finish my sentences. <laughs> all right. Well, we should probably get going. Yeah. Ow! What the fuck? I'm not even playing! Because you're a chicken? You're a chicken! <laughs> I hate this kid so much. You want to fuck him up? Yeah, I do. You asked for it. You better run, you little shits. Holy <laughs> shit! Get to cover. Go, go. Quick shot. We're on the board, suckers. Hold on that kid. <laughs> oh, gotta get some snow. Uh, I'm gonna okay. come over okay. there and fight cool, you, cool, like cool, for cool. real. That was terrible. Oh, get some I'm more snow. For you, tiny. Oh. <laughs> Eat hey, you can't run for me. I got more for you. Be more where that came from. Oh, oh you like that? Don't tell your mom. Oh, oh, dang it. oh, suck oh another it. one. You better be making In some snowballs, kid. Move within range and look at a target to lock on. Okay, I get it. I have to get within range, though. Hey, you. Just stand there, you stupid kid. <laughs> Gotta get to ten you here. Oh, it's okay. Uh -huh. Eat it, shrimps. Hey, how's it feel? <laughs> no, get her! Help me! Oh, you'll never get away with this. Oh, we need to pile on. Get off of your monsters! Ellie. Ellie. <laughs> all right, all right. We actually have some work to do. Scram. Oh, man. I guess I asked for that, huh? Yep. Let's go. That was a cute way to teach you how to throw objects in the game. So, Jesse wants us to do the creek trails. He's gonna relieve Joel and Tommy. Oh, that's nice he assigned us together. You're gonna like this route. Morning, girls. Morning. Hey, ladies. I'll bring them in. Thank you. You've done a real nice job of making this place seem alive. Really nice. All right, let's go talk to this guy. What's up, man? Look who's here. Thanks. Come on. Hey, Shimmer. There are a lot of people in this town. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One for you. And one for you. Open it up. Settle down, children. All right. You all know the drill. Run your routes, mark your log books, clear any infected you see. You run into anything you can't handle. You come back. Be smart about it. All right. Hmm. Get going. I have a feeling we're going to need to make a decision here. We're going to be forced to make a decision between continuing on or coming back. Just the thoughts.
What were you dreaming about? Was I talking? You're doing your teeth grinding thing. Where have you been? Grab your gear. I want to show you something. What? Trust me. Come on. This way. Hmm. Interesting. So we're playing as this woman now. Who are these people? I liked how the subtitles get, didn't give their names away, because we don't know who these people are yet. Just woman and man. Don't know where they are. Don't know if they're good or bad. Or somewhere in between. <sighs> it's cold. Are you sure you don't want to do this when the sun's out? And it's warmer? No. Can't wait. And you don't want to just tell me? You need to see it. This guy's kind of giving me the creeps, man. Really nice snow effects. Walking through the snow. Sound effects are quite nice. What are you doing wandering around out here by yourself? Been restless. You too? I feel like the farther south we go, the prettier it's gotten. You want to keep going? And just drive all the way to Mexico? I've thought about it. You can see Manny's hometown. <laughs> yeah, I don't see that living up to his stories somehow. Yeah, no, probably not. Ooh. Boy, I crouched all the way down. You did all this in the dark? Yes. Now, come on. Keep going like this. We're gonna be tired for today's trip. It's not that far. Hey, is Mel okay? She seemed out of it these past few days. She'll be fine. You stop being weird. You're freaking me out. I'm not being <laughs> weird. You're being a little weird, dude. Careful jumping over these. <laughs> Are you breaking up with Mel? What? No. <laughs> you wish. Uh, I've had my fill. Thank you. You're gonna have to run to make it. I didn't make it. I warned you. I did it on purpose. Uh. Your ego. Well, I did hold down L1. I just didn't do it quickly enough. <laughs> just give yourself a good run. Oh, okay. Yeah, I did. I really did. Alright, let's try this again. Run. Ouch. We can't go. all be as graceful as you. Clearly. What is that? You'll be fine. It's too high. Come on. Oh, jeez. Shit. I don't like this. It's slippery. Hey. Eyes on me. Abby. Stop looking down. My name is Abby. Owen, do we have to go back this Owen. way? Consider it an opportunity to work on your fears. How about I work my foot up your ass? Abby, stop flirting. <laughs> Lots of these little narrow passageways to squeeze, squeeze through. Is it? We made it. Holy shit. It's a fucking city. Yeah. Have you told anyone else? I wanted you to see it first. 
saw an armed patrol go from town to an outpost over there. A few more outposts in between. They have electricity, guns. It's a lot of people. We can figure it out. Okay. Assuming he's in there, how do we get to him? We can corner one of the patrols and get confirmation, and then, I don't know, maybe find a way to lure him out. Yeah, okay. I'm sure they'll be happy to offer that information up. Well, then we make them. You hear yourself? Okay, what do you want to do? What is going on with you? Mel's pregnant. Oh. Okay. It's not just that, though. Should I say congrats? When everyone else sees this, they're gonna want to turn back. We can convince them, right? I fucking knew I couldn't count on you. Happy. I want what you want. But not at any cost. Hey. Don't! See you back at the lodge. Interesting. So, I don't really know what's going on here. I'll do the whole thing on my own. She wanted to lure somebody out of the town. He, well, and then and then we know that once everybody else finds out about this, they're going to want to turn back. So apparently the people that they're with do not want the same thing that Abby here wants. Which way am I supposed to go? <laughs> that is a long way down, man. So probably not that way. Up here, maybe? So, and then the dude... He tells her that Mel's pregnant. And I kind of was getting the impression that maybe he wanted to go into the town, maybe to maybe find a doctor or something, you know? That's what I thought. That's what I thought he was going for. Do I have to jump over there now? Now where am I going? Well, not down there. And um, I mean, can I? Do I go this way, or does that just take me right back to where I was? Look how look how deep the snow is here. Uh, jeez. <laughs> ah, um, I think if I go down there, I'm just going to end up right back where I was, but if I go that way, then I just keep going up. I just don't know. Well, here's a tree. So this is a good sign, I think. Yeah, I'm thinking this looks pretty good. Okay. That was fun. Oof. He got Mel pregnant. She seemed pretty Shit. upset about that. Whoa. Oh, crap. Is this thing alive? Let's loot it. Are you alive? Doesn't look like it. 
We have three bullets. That's all we've got. Oh, geez, there's another. Oh, oh, there's a bunch of them. Bunch of them. Can't loot these guys. Oh, I wish I could loot them. Oh, holy hell. What That's the? That is a lot of them. What the hell? Oh, crap. Did you hear that? Is that just the wind? I may have heard something in that direction. It sounded like it was far away, though. It's a lot of bodies, man. I don't like that. I've only got three bullets. What is this woman thinking? Going off with three freaking bullets. Uh, are we going to squeeze through here? Yeah. Oh, jeez. I don't like this camera angle. This is horror movie camera angle. Oh, shit. Yep. Oh, oh gosh. What the hell's going on? Oh, boy. Oh, another body. That one looks like it's going to get up and move. That one right there. Okay. Melee the hell out of this guy, man. Save our bullets. You son of a bitch. Oh boy. Oh jeez. Oh golly jeez. Oh gosh. Oh jeez. So you think that I mean after a while, wouldn't there be they would the infected would run out of people to infect? Wouldn't you think that after a while that would happen? I wonder how long that would take. I guess so long as... Jeez, oh people are still procreating. Oh crap, another one? Oh, jeepers. Oh, I gotta finish this one off. Oh boy, good thing we're Oh man, can I get any bullets from these guys? We found a house here. You can see that we got a little bit of My shoulder. blood splatter. In. Uh, R2, hold to heal. Equip the health kits. Okay, hold R2 to heal. Okay, so that's my health in the lower right hand corner down there. Alright. We need to get a view. Can we climb in this window here, maybe? That's what I'm thinking. I don't know how I feel about climbing in here, though. Click R3 to toggle your flashlight. Oh, boy. Okay. Well, so... It was a long time ago when I played the game. Like I said, I played it when it first came out. I think that was about seven years ago, so don't remember a lot of the mechanics. I don't remember what kind of looting you can do. Um, I think you could like find parts to make things, repair things maybe. Uh, here's some bullets, because people just leave bullets lying around, don't you know? How do I get out of here? Okay. How do we get out of here? Yeah, we're not going to get out from that door. I don't like how she's holding her gun. It's making me nervous. Oh, look at this. Okay, we're going to go prone here in a moment. First, we're going to look around in here a little bit more to see if there's some more stuff for us to pick up. Okay, it doesn't look like there is. Which is too bad. So, uh, I'm suspicious of those bullets that were sitting there. Who left those there? Who just leaves bullets sitting around? 
Maybe I'm reading too much into it, I don't know, but I have a feeling somebody's been here already. Oh gosh, I don't like this at all. Yeah, Abby, this is a very bad idea. Let's move slowly. Let's turn off our light. Up, oh, right there. Right there. Do I have a knife? Aim and shoot. That's a pretty good shot, if I may say so myself. <laughs> Not usually that good of a shot. <laughs> sneak past this guy here. I hate that we had to use one of our bullets. I would have rather tried to sneak up behind him and stab him with a knife. Maybe we don't have a knife. Maybe he heard me before I had that opportunity. Where's that lookout? Where's that lookout? Check around the corner there. I came back in here hopes of finding more items could very well save our life more bullets more health kits there we go see that's why you search man you search to find stuff now you could also find things that you don't want to find like other infected or bad guys but I think in this case it's worth the risk that's how I feel about it. Can't open that door. It's impossible. It's impossible to pass through that door. Ah, yes. More pistol bullets just lying around. People. Yeah, so it looks like a note. Oh, it is a note. Cool. Oh, let's read it. To anyone who reads this. My name is Seth. I'm from San Francisco, trying to get to Jackson with my two sons. We lost our car, our compass, our guns. We were raided outside of Reno. My wife and my eldest were killed. I've been trying to follow maps, but the snow makes it impossible to hold onto the road for very long. I was hoping to wait out these storms, but my boys are starving. I haven't seen so much as a squirrel in a week. I can't sit here and watch them waste away. We're going to head out west-northwest. I heard what sounded like gunshots over there across the ridge. Hopefully we'll find people. Hopefully they'll be kind. Please, if you read this, come find us. I think it's Wednesday. God bless you. Well, how do you like that? How do you like that? Put it away. I guess we're going to keep it. So, glad we came in here. Find a note. Turn off our flashlights. We're going to walk down here towards this fence. we got another house down here. Okay. Alright. Okay. It's got to be close. Gotta be close. So, I have no idea how the save works in this game. Save game. New manual save. Okay, cool. Looks like we could save wherever we want. That's important. It's important to know. Because it's time for me to end this episode right here. Thank you guys so much for joining me on this first hour or so. The Last of Us Part 2. Like I said at the starting, I'm glad you're here with me. I would not want to do this alone. We come back next time. We'll keep moving forward here as this Abbey woman. Uh, if we can get into this house, we'll do that. We'll look around. See if we could find some stuff that might help us survive. Hopefully not find things that will do the opposite. <laughs> well, thank you for joining me. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, why don't you let me know? Maybe leave me a like, maybe leave me a comment, maybe, I don't know, share this video with your friends. If you're not a subscriber, why not subscribe? Click the little bell icon so that you're notified whenever I post a new video. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you join me again in the next episode.